These are five scientific ways I like to reset my day. Number one, a morning walk because this activates your internal clock. And this is important because it stabilizes your serotonin and cortisol. And so in turn, will stabilize your mood and your focus. Number two is stimulating the vagus nerve. And you can do this in a lot of ways, but one of the most simple, effective ways is to practice box breathing. You breathe in for four counts, hold for four counts, exhale for four counts, and then hold for four counts and repeat. This will help regulate your heart rate and your mood. Number three is going for a discomfort walk. Now I actually got this idea from Michael Easter and his book, The Comfort Crisis. It essentially says that our modern comforts has made us pretty fragile. And so exposing ourselves to uh, daily stresses really builds up our body's tolerance and our brain's resilience. Number four is to express gratitude. <laughs> gratitude activates the medial prefrontal cortex and interior cingulate cortex. And these are your brain's controls on emotions, decision-making, your attention span, and it helps it rest out your amygdala, which is where all that fear and stress hangs out. <laughs> So as you change your brain chemistry by doing this a lot, you start to get more dopamine and less stress. Number five is to take time in silence. This is probably the hardest one for some of you, but there are studies from both Duke and Harvard showing that silence can actually grow the hippocampus, which will improve your emotional regulation and your attention. So how do you choose to regulate yourself today?